So what is the CIM that we mentioned last week? The cruel and impossible marathon that we said we're all running. It is the pursuit of happiness. Every human being deeply wants to be happy. That's how we're built. That's what we're all made up of. That's humanity. So what's cruel and what's impossible about it? The problem is, like in our muscle of last week, as we get things that should bring us joy, we lose the simcha in them as we attain them. And then we're really pushing the finish line another five miles forward because now we want bigger things and different things to make us happy. But then when we get to those other things, we're not going to be happy with them. So think about it. We are, in fact, running on this cruel and impossible marathon. So now there are only two rational possibilities. I emphasize the word rational. Possibility number one is to give up on the pursuit of happiness in total. It won't happen. Let's forget about it. That's a rational possibility because you're not running a race which is impossible to win. The other possibility is Sameach Bechalko, to start becoming happy with what we have. But I want you to appreciate for a moment and maybe take a second and stop the video and think about that, that to continue running on this race is not rational and it's really cruel and impossible and it's foolish. So those are the possibilities in front of us, either to stop running the race or to start learning how to be Sameach Bechalko, to start enjoying and being happy with the things we have, to be happy with our lot in a true way. And Bezra Hashem, that's what we're going to investigate in the next few weeks. How can we bring this amazing basic idea of Sameach Bechalko more in our lives and finally get out of this cruel and impossible marathon?